Can you hear me? Yes, yes, I can. I I can hear you. But but I'm actually going to be quinterviewing you. Hey everybody, it's your good buddy Chris Fafalius here. Welcome to the third episode of Quinterviews. And actually, this is the second time we'll be filming the third episode because the first time we filmed the third episode, it was so controversial that we had to film it again because YouTube was already warning me. They said, you can't post that. You're making a big deal out of me. Right? Yeah, 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 of course. You know, making a joke out of me, so I don't care. No, 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 no. So we had to do it again. I have my good friend John J.B. Brown with me. He's from the band Bright and Early, and I'm really honored to have him on the show. JB, it's great to have you on the show. It's great to be here. Yeah, it's great to have you on the show. It's great to be had on the show. <laughs> it's great to have you on the show today, and I also have two co-hosts today. Uh, we have one co-host, his name is Marcus. Heck yeah. And we have another co-host, his name is Dom. You got it. They're going to be it's helping me. They're going to be helping me out throughout the entire episode, and I have some great questions planned out for you. It's Quinn of you, so it's five questions. That's awesome. awesome. My first question is, JB, your new single is called Always On My Mind. Wish I could change your mind. I wouldn't have to walk away. Can you tell me something that's never on your mind? interview I gave a great answer but I can't remember what I said. Well you know what JB we can actually take that answer that you gave from the last episode and put it in right here from the controversial episode. That'd be cool. <sighs> Probably not if it's never on my mind. Aww. Because if I could tell you what was on my mind then it would have had to be there at some point and that's not never. Whoa! JB Sometimes you say controversial things in your songs, or in your tweets, or in your Facebook status updates. Do you think you could say something controversial on this episode of Quinter Views so I can get some more YouTube views? That is a great question. Sure, uh, gay marriage. <laughs> That's controversial, right? Abortion. That's awesome. Those things are controversial. Let's say a to mouth. We never do a to mouth. That's a perfect answer. Alright. <laughs> JB, the next question is the hot button question. Oh, yeah. JB, what's your opinion on stem cell research? <laughs> uh, I've never liked stems myself. <laughs> That's all I really can say about that. JB, I'm going to take a break in the show right here and uh, show a video of Paul playing a Descendants song on his guitar. Yeah. You got it. JB, my next question for you is, your nickname is JB. What does it mean? Well, I used to be in this tribe, like when I grew up, I was raised by Indians. And <laughs> I can't really say the name that they gave me, but it ended up turning into John Brown. And everybody just calls me JB for short. <laughs> that's, that's where that originated from. JB, my final question for you is, would you like to see a video of my dog playing with a toy bunny? JB, 
JB, it's been great having you on Quit Reviews. Uh, we had a very controversial Lost episode that people might see someday and they might not. <laughs> but um, it's great having you on Quit Reviews for the second time, even though these people were just watching it for the first time. You have a new single out on Modern Short Stories. It's called Always On My Mind. Everyone can pick that up for 99 cents. That's the same cost as a piece of gum. BrandonAirlyMusic.com What? BrandonAirlyMusic.com That's a, If they go to that, it'll just send them right to the store. Great interview. What if I knew it years ago and it felt the same way now? Could it take away your doubts? Could it's time to fit the pancakes.